羨ましくなって。It's wild that she just does not understand that this man likes her for who she is. Look at her reveal. Today, we're going to check out episode 9 of Kimi ni Todoke from me to you. But before we do, if you enjoy the video, maybe you want to like and comment. Maybe you want to subscribe to the channel. That way, you can check out more of these reactions. And you can find the full length as well as exclusives over on Patreon. Exclusives like this. Like, this has been on Patreon for a while. I do live streams on Twitch where I react to anime and maybe play games and stuff by the time this is coming out. If you like non anime reactions, maybe you'll enjoy my second channel where I react to stuff that's not anime. That includes some like romance stuff, so I don't know. Maybe you're interested. A lot of K dramas, maybe some J dramas. We'll see. Just, just take a look. All right. Hey, you watch your fat cone head, sir. Damn! She blasted that shit. <laughs> I like the mm, the fucking evil looking. I kicked it. By the way, today's the day that he's supposed to get his uh, his cone removed. So, or he's supposed to get his. Stitch is checked up on, and then we would potentially not have to put him in a cone anymore. How was the kick? It came to me from you. Uh, just we see, she said, from me to you. I have feel oily. Aww. Dude, I wonder how they handle the live action version of this. I might actually watch the live action version of this. There's so many moments where like the comedy comes through more because of the way that it's drawn like this. And there's no way to guarantee that like that comedy is still going to shine in live action. She's not looking for Kazuhaya. She's lying. She's looking for you. She's the one that spread the rumors, though. She's like Kazehayakun. Interesting. But what you don't know is she's actually a demon. You don't want to be her. You're better than her already. <laughs> yeah, she said you look like a doll, but you think she looks like a doll. <laughs> she had to pinch herself. That fucking bitch. I told you she was a bitch. She she said she looks like a cursed doll. I fucking knew it. She's a bitch. I hope Truck Coon comes and isekai's her ass. Oh, see, they they also see it the same way as the the first guy, the girl said it. Ah. <laughs> 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 Oh, dude, I bet she's gonna be like, ew, don't come, you don't know me. I bet she's gonna show her, tr please show your true colors. <laughs> no, that's not it. <laughs> He's close, it kind of rhymed. 
It's so funny. Do you know Sadako's full name? And then he literally doesn't even say Sadako. Like, he, he literally got half of it given to him. He could have botched it and been closer with the first name. He said Takako. He could have just said Sadako. I like that. <laughs> I love the little the, the little noises that she... <laughs> like stuff like that. <laughs> a little, dude, she has such a big head in this little... Oh. Dude, your fucking satellite dish is in my way, dude. Can't see a fucking thing. Whoa! The radar, sir! I can't see! Alright, I signed up for, for cable. I need a cable box, not a fucking satellite dish. Jeez. She's a bully, dude. <laughs> Everyone's heart's beating. Must be hot. Damn summer. It's crazy in schools in Japan. They just open up all the windows in the summer. It's hot as fuck. That's crazy. Like, all right, here's your AC. It's the wind that doesn't exist. Or I guess in this case does exist. He forgets everything that she talks to him about because he doesn't care about her. He cares about her. <laughs> oh my god. Don't do that. Yeah, don't do that. Something horrifying flashed in my mind. You dumbass. Can How does she not notice that this man, Kazehaya, likes her? Why are you guys giving her those eyes? Those aren't her eyes, are they? Yo, some of these hairs are like, what? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, we like this one the best. Stay this way. <laughs> it's just shorter or longer, but the same thing. I wonder why. Who said you look like a doll? Oh. So they get that that's what she meant when they said that she looked like a doll. I like that they understood that they were, it was probably not a nice thing that the person was saying. Why? It's wild that she just does not understand that this man likes her for who she is. I don't understand that. I don't get how she can't see it. It seems so obvious to me. <laughs> Grab as many balls as you like. Whoa. I don't think that's how it was meant, but it does come out a little weird. They have a very similar personality. I wouldn't be surprised if that was like her big brother. Aww. And they're friends with this bitch too. I don't think that... Whatever. Echo and Tomo. I don't think that they know that um the one girl's a fucking bitch. Oh, I seen you with that committee girl hat. Huh? 
Oh yeah, he calls them. He calls the other girls. I forgot their names. Um, to Toya. How do I forget names so fast? Anyways, uh, Chizu and Ayane. I think was their names, their first names. But I think he calls them by their last names. So this is the only girl that he calls by a first name. I wonder why. She was probably insistent on it, right? Like, no, call me Kudumi. <laughs> You're, you're worried about maybe him liking somebody else. That's all this is. I don't think so. It may or may not. I think more often than not, calling somebody by their given name is a special thing. Is he going to call her Sawako? Stillmate. Just say it. Hey, Kazahaya, why you call Kurumi by her first name and not me? Why can't you say my first name? Say it. Say it. Say it, Sawako. Is he gonna say her first name right now? I think he is. Here he goes. Do it. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Do it. Sawako. Sa 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 geo sa sa geo. No. He was trying to say your name. Oh, she didn't realize what it was. Uh, uh, you're misinterpreting everything. Kurumi sees it. Kurumi knows. Kurumi knows that Kazahaya likes Sabako. Sabako thinks Kazahaya likes Kurumi. Kazahaya thinks Kurumi... Wait. Nah, you're thinking about him just enough. This fucking bitch. How dare she? There's probably diseases on that napkin. I would not believe her. She probably fucking put like a uh, uh, fucking polio on it or something. Sickness, definitely. She probably, one day when she was really sick, she coughed into it just to touch it on her face just now. An idol and her fan. Oh, damn, she was about to say fan. She's like, eh, fantastic! Uh, friends! Uh, English! <laughs> What's up? Where are you going? You were so comfortable! Oh! Something activated him. I feel like the girls know that she's a fucking bitch, right? A rotten ass bitch. I think they, I think they know, right? Dude, I don't know, man. Something about the percussion or whatever in that up in the ED. I just love it. I don't. I want to learn more about the history between Kazehaya and Kurumi, and now. Kurumi, I guess, is friends with Sabako. Though, I will say, Kurumi saying she looks like a doll as she's walking away. She's like a fucking, yeah, scary-ass fucking demon doll. Or like a cursed doll. That's what she said, a cursed doll. So she's not nice, bro. And I'm 99% sure she's the one that spread the rumors. We'll probably find that out in the coming episodes. I'm, I imagine that it's going to come to head as a mid-season climax for the show. So around episode 12 or 11 is when the real confrontation will occur. We'll see. Good though. Good episode. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. And if you enjoyed the video, like and comment. It helps with the algorithm and recommends this to other people so they can enjoy it too. And while you're at it, maybe subscribe to the channel. That way you can see more of these reactions. Till next time, make sure you all keep it fresh. Peace.